Well, it's the 10th day of Vita. I know this because it's April 10, 10th, 2012, and it's time for Comments X, the Vita edition. Yep. Vlogging every day in April. That's the fun part. Uh, I, I do enjoy participating in these things in, uh, around the uh, on YouTube. Uh, it gives you, it, it gives you more of a, a community feeling. I know everyone's going to VidCon. A lot of people are going to VidCon, but uh, um, one of the uh, one of the people who won't be able, won't be there because uh, I can't get across the border. <laughs> yeah, my uh, my political wranglings has uh, gotten me to a point where uh, I don't have any ID to cross the border, and I will not cross cross the border uh, until. Uh, the TSA gets until the U.S. until the United States gets rid of its uh, its uh, uh, ID its ID requirements and sort of its its um, its sort of uh, what I call it a criminal strip search of uh, of a person. I mean, if if you read the U.S. Constitution, read read the amendments of the Constitution, you'll see that what the United States is doing at the border is, is fully unconstitutional and fully un-American. So uh, until this changes until the United States is back in line with its pro properly back in line with the, with its constitution. Uh, I will not be crossing the border anytime soon. Uh, that being said, uh, on to the more mundane and uh, less uh, politically charged areas. Uh, uh, I got the news broadcast off tonight. I uh, did the uh, weekly report for the economics channel. And in a few minutes, I will be doing the next segment for Adventures in the Library, which is always lots of fun. And uh, uh, it, if anyone who is interested in books and reading, uh, you want to sort of figure out where you want to go next and, t you know, if, if this might be a career for you, uh, this sort of is a look into library research and how research is actually done inside of a library. So I think uh, for those of you who enjoy reading in a library, that would be fun. And I certainly consider it fun because I do enjoy libraries. I like libraries so much. That's uh, so what I wanted to do as a kid, and uh, I'm doing it now. I know a lot of people want to be firemen and so on and so forth. Why do you want to be... Why do I be a little boy? I want to be a scientist and a librarian. Wee! <laughs> yeah, I was, that was that, that was my 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 love affair as a, as a child. I, I always I liked I liked libraries and books. I mean, if I could <laughs> if I could have back then, I would have moved into a library and sort of lived there, just put a bed in the library, and I'd be happy. Uh, but. Uh, well, I had, I had a sort of a library. My my dad had a had a had a pretty good sized library when he was when I was little. So I used to play all the time in there. That's that's where I sort of started off. And of course, I was as as uh, I was playing in there. One of the records we had is the uh, 2001 Space Odyssey, and uh, <laughs> grew out of that. <laughs> uh, but that uh. What am I going to go next? Hmm? What am I going to talk about next? Everyone's sitting on the couch here wondering what we're going to talk about next. Uh, not much to talk about because I, you will be seeing I got my uh, comments Y off. I got the little, uh, the, the little DVD player so you can see that. Uh, what I'll be working on next is I will be doing a lot more of the vlogging like Cassandra does where it's on video. And I put together the video clips. That's going to be in comments Y as well. So far, I think it's going to be in comments why. Uh, basically, I've got three sections now to, uh, oh, four sections, three main sections to uh, Big Bang Theory. There's comments X, which is this. This is the main component. So this is the main axis. On comments Y, going into the second dimension, uh, we have uh, any the any video I comment on. Uh, on YouTube, uh, we'll have more. Uh, I'll be doing more video comments. That's why I want to be in comments. Why? And then Z. I don't know what I should call. It. I don't know because they're not actually comments. Z is going to be gifts and other miscellaneous. Uh, so if I give a gift to somebody, if uh, let's say someone wants an, uh, a video converted or whatever they want, 
uh, I'll produce the gift in there uh, and just sort of leave it in that part right there. Then, of course, there's the collab I, I, I give a gift to on a regular basis. That's Right and Proper Ladies. So Right and Proper Ladies has its own list, and the stuff will be going in there. Uh, got to check and sort of see what's been going on, on for this week. I haven't checked uh, Right and Proper Ladies yet for this week to see what the theme is, but I will do that shortly uh, as I finish up. <laughs> I'm finishing up, and what's happening is around 7 o'clock, and the sun is coming up. It's starting to be daylight, and uh, uh, once again, uh, the night has passed me by, and I'll be going. I'm going to be going to going to be going to bed when everyone else is sleeping. It isn't too bad of an idea, you know, too bad of a thing. And it's is, and this reminds me of the the cool thing that happened this weekend is that uh, I got a visit from the Freegan Ferry, and uh, a list left left a nice little dresser drawer that I uh, put in my closet and allowed them to clean my clean my closet up a little bit more. Uh, so I'm almost finished the cleaning enough so that uh, I think by uh, well it's, it's not going to be this because this week uh, uh, the vlogging I'll be doing is be doing outside at my second home at church and you'll see that for a bit and you'll see uh, how Greek Easter approaches so you'll be see, I'll be doing a bit for that too so you'll be able to see in the montage and, and comments why there you'll be able to see uh, uh, Greek Easter and how it actually unfolds. They unfold all this way for you, but this is the way, the way it originally, originally unfolded. You know, you start off with Palm Sunday, then you have church all week long. Wednesday starts the big services. Uh, uh, for for, uh, for Pascha, and I shouldn't call it Easter, it's actually called Pascha. Uh, the Roman Catholics call theirs Easter, and we start calling it Greek Easter, but it's not really Greek Easter. It's Pascha. The Greeks know it as Pascha, which means little Passover. And so that's why you'll hear you'll hear Greeks telling each other Kolo Pascha, and you know, Kolo Pascha means good, good Pascha. And they also, oh yeah, it says the other one. It's Kolo Pascha and Kali Anastasi. That's those are the, the two phrases. And then at Pascha, and you'll you'll, you'll hear me saying this. They say another phrase when they meet each other. It says "Christos Anesti," and th so the, uh, the 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 salutation is "Christos Anesti." The reply is "Aethos Anesti," and the precursor to that is "Kolo Anesti." Uh, 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 <laughs> this is what happens when <laughs> you don't have enough sleep, your mind starts blanking out on you, things you're supposed to remember, just... But I think I'm always in that sort of sleep-deprived mood, and <laughs> Cassandra, I think, is starting to experience this, that sort of that state of almost permanent sleep deprivation. So she's, uh... That's sort of part of the fun of her videos, where she, she shows the bizarreness of, of lack of sleep and what happens to you. Anyway, I'm going to go off and do uh, uh, Adventures in the Library next, in the next five minutes. And then uh, probably by quarter past, uh, maybe 7.30, you'll start seeing me pop up on the antenna on on, uh, on the channel here. Because I've got a few more things to do before I start uh, uh, clicking around and doing the stroll around YouTube. All right, take it easy. I'll see you a little bit later on as the day passes.